Hi there. Welcome to MCSI. My name is Sonia. In this video, I will give you an introduction to using geospatial data for open source intelligence. Geospatial data refers to location-based information retrieved from a map or a camera. Now, I will tell you about the different types of geospatial data sources available. Various tools allow you to view the map of any region in the world. The map can display a bird's eye view of a region, a terrain view, and even a street view where you can view a particular location and its surroundings as if you are currently present in that location. You can identify the accurate GPS coordinates of any location using online maps. Likewise, you can input latitude, longitude information and view that region on a map. When a pin code is provided as input, some tools would highlight on a map the region represented by that pin code. This is helpful when you have an address specific to a target. Some websites store current and historical aerial maps and aerial imagery of important locations. Special maps have been designed to track natural events like earthquakes, hurricanes, and storms. You can also view the live data captured by street cameras in multiple parts across the world. Special maps have been designed to represent live air traffic. You can follow the movement of an aircraft across the globe. Likewise, you can track movement of marine traffic like ships and fishing vessels. Now, I will tell you about the different ways in which geospatial data is useful for OSINT. When an OSINT professional is investigating a target, interesting images can be geolocated using geospatial tools. If the target has updated information about their whereabouts on social media, the OSINT professional can use that information to track the target's activities on a map. Journalists can use open street cameras to become aware of the events in a location especially during times of political unrest. A journalist can also use aerial imagery and historical maps while investigating a target. Law enforcement can use air and marine traffic tracking tools to track criminal activities. The various sources of geospatial data are a rich source of information for open source intelligence across various fields. Now, I will give you a brief overview about some tools that you can use for geospatial OSINT. The well-known search engines like Google, Bing, and Yandex all provide a maps feature that can be used during an OSINT investigation. If you are logged into a Gmail account, you can even save places of interest on Google Maps for quick future access. There are numerous other tools designed only for specific purposes, for example, to display only air traffic, to display latest aerial imagery for a region, to show only the street cameras, etc. We will explore some of those tools in upcoming videos. I hope you have a good idea now about the different geospatial data available for open source intelligence. If you liked this video, please hit like and share this video on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this one. Join our online community of students learning useful cybersecurity skills if you haven't already. To register for a free account right away, go to our website. Happy learning and see you soon!